Just got this Drill Master um, orbital polisher and waxer here from Harbor Freight, so I thought I'd do a quick overview to it. Um, I don't have the right stuff that I need to get the marking out of, out of my car, but um, I might try it anyway just so you can see how it works. It is a two-prong plug, not a three, and it's a one-speed. one, one speed. It's 10-inch, uh, um, 3,000 uh, orbits per minute, um, you know. Decent as far as weight goes. Not very heavy. I just opened this package a minute ago, so that's why uh, you'll see it open here. But it has a foam bottom that's you know kind of cheap. The bottom of it is definitely, like I said, a little cheap. It's got some foam, like a soft foam here, and then a harder foam there. I'm gonna go on a limb and say I think this thing will come off to be replaced because if it doesn't. I'm not sure this is going to hold up for forever, that's for sure. Um, very light, not heavy at all. There's your on-off switch. you got two handles, so you can hold it on either side. And a really short cord, so you definitely need an extension cord because uh, that's the extent of your cord right there. And, you know, let me just see if I can fire it up and you get a sense of the, the speed and the sound that it makes. And I did get a bonnet. It doesn't come with any other accessories. It doesn't come with any bottom things or anything like that. Any pads. Nothing like that. As it says here, 1 amp, 3,000 RPMs. I think it costs 20 bucks at Harbor Freight. So not a bad price. Let's see how, how, it, uh, how it goes. So along with that, I got one of these bonnets here. So, uh, you know, fleece, obviously to polish. I know there's other different type of ones. This was like 3 bucks, so I thought I'd get it. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on. I, I know I have polishing compound, but I don't know exactly where it is, so I'd have to dig around for it. But I'm going to put this bonnet on and, you know, fire it up so you can take a look, see what you think. And by all means, let me know if you have it, if you're thinking about getting one like this, and, you know, what your thoughts are, what your experiences have been with it, and uh, let's hook this up. I put this bonnet on pretty easily. It's just a uh, elastic around there. Slap that around the bottom, and... Uh, Real quick, I'm gonna see if I can find some polishing compound and see if I can do something with this scratch on my wife's car here. No, uh, test it out on that. So it's obviously not gonna get the deeper things, but it might get some of this color off. Let's see if I can film this with one hand here. Not super loud. This, um, it's obviously a little bit random the way it goes. But, uh, yep, apparently this is carpet. And uh, that's the deal. Let me just see what it can do as far as as far as this goes, if anything. I'm going to try to film with one hand and rub it with this hand. So you can see there's blue there. See if it does anything here. Kai. Kai. Yeah, who knows? Kai. There's a, maybe a tinge of blue. But anyway, I don't have any compound right now to rub this out. But I'd love to do that and maybe try that out and if I get around to doing that I'll definitely film definitely film it for you but um, kind of looks like I might be getting a little bit of it out so any rate that's uh, that's your drill master from Harbor Freight and I uh, hope you find this video useful. And uh, like I say, comment below. Give it a thumbs up if you like it. And, uh, you know, let me know what your experience is if you, had, if you have one of these. Daddy. Yeah, right here.
done, bud. So, what do I do? Turn it off. 